Hi, today I'm going to show you how to check your fuel pressure on a 2001 Chevy Silverado. First you're going to need an 8 millimeter socket and that's to take this off right here, the uh, little uh, cover. And after you do that, you're going to need a uh, fuel uh, injection pressure test gauge and I picked mine up at Harbor Freight and I believe the item number is 92699 I believe but uh, got it for around 20 bucks and uh, helped me diagnose uh, a uh, faulty fuel pump okay I'm gonna start by loosening up the bolt here it's not on very tight um, Okay, I've got the bolt loose, and then what you do is just lift up, kind of pull it back. Then you'll see a couple of different things on here, but where you test your fuel pressure at is right here. This little nipple right here. Sit there and unscrew it. And there you see that. Uh, we'll go ahead and... Uh, Get this on here now one thing you have to watch out about is, is there is pressure with this and might be worth it to get a rag I don't have one but um, go ahead and show you what you do here take your fuel pressure gauge you screw it you push it in like I said there'll, there'll be some gas come out get that in there you can see, no, of course, not showing any fuel pressure. I'm going to go ahead and uh, hop in my car right fast, start it up, and then you'll see what the fuel pressure is showing. Now, keep in mind that this is brand new fuel pump, and it is showing the correct pressure, pressure which is uh, 50 to 55 PSI. And uh, I think anything below that, uh, you're going to have a bad fuel pump or maybe a dirty fuel filter and it's best whenever you change your fuel pump to go ahead and change your fuel filter at the same time uh, just to just to take care of anything uh, you know that uh, any kind of fault or anything like that but uh, anyway let me go ahead and start my truck up and uh, you'll see this fuel pressure gauge jump at, jump up to the correct level okay, as you can see here fuel pressure gauge is showing that uh, uh, maybe 50 and a half PSI. Like I said, uh, one thing that uh, was going on with mine is, is uh, all of a sudden cut, it kind of cut out on me. Then uh, got stopped, and uh, whenever I went to try to start it back up, it wouldn't start. And I've heard fuel, uh, um, the fuel pressure units. Uh, or fuel pump rather, excuse me, that, uh, you know, sometimes when it starts to go out, it, it can go out all at once. That's why you see a lot of cars broken down on the side of the road. Sometimes it might gradually start going out. And, uh, you know, it uh, might where you get where your car is hard to start, everything like that. Fuel pressure might not be getting there, but whenever I checked my fuel pressure, uh, trying to start it, uh, it was getting up to about 10 PSI, then slowly dropping off. And it would kind of stay running really rough but uh, not uh, wasn't doing what it was supposed to of course because it wasn't going anywhere luckily I wasn't broke down on the side of the road and in a parking lot so I was able to get my tools and drop a tank and change it but uh, anyway like I said it's uh, 50 to 55 PSI is typically what it'll show this is on the 2001 Chevy Silverado Z71 uh, and the part number is uh, 92699 on harborfreight.com for the uh, fuel injector tester kit but uh, anyway if you uh, have any questions don't hesitate to post something up I'll try to help you out and answer anything I can and again uh, appreciate you watching my video thanks bye